Yo, what's going on guys? In this video, I'm gonna be showing you how to carry low ELO Smurf Q on Karthus. These players are anywhere from gold to platinum ELO since they are high win rates or higher rank in previous season. I didn't even really get a leash this game, only one attack from Senna, and I didn't go Ravenous Hunter either. I went Ultimate Hunter, but at the end of our leash, we'll be finishing 315 and with full HP as well. I'm not that crazy about Ravenous Hunter on Karthus at the moment because of that reason. Clears just this season are so healthy because Gromp heals you so much and the jungle items give you way too much healing in general. On Karthus, you don't really want to go flash anymore, particularly if the enemy team has a lot of melee champs. Having the exhaust holds them still for your Qs to land, for your Es to land, and it keeps them from one-shot bursting you. It's also really nice to have in team fights late game when you toss it on a hyper carry like Yon, they can't kill anybody. Karthus is one of the few champions that can hyper carry in Iron or in Challenger and every elo in between as long as you are farming properly. So if you need to go back, slow this down, figure out how I'm farming properly, placements of the Qs and moving in between each Q. You generally don't auto attack that much on Karthus. You only auto maybe once every two Qs if that because it's more important to stay mobile and land every Q on its own because your auto attacks on Karthus have a really long cast time to where, like I said, it's generally a Q auto, Q, Q auto, Q, Q auto. And then as the game drags on, you'll be autoing less and less and less. It's, it's, it is still really important to do during ganks. And you'll see me do that a lot in this game. During ganks, I'll be pinching off lots of autos because you don't want to just waste a Q and miss because casting a Q takes time. So you might as well guarantee land an auto instead and walk with them since they're going to be perma juking and you can stay on top of them that way. Anyways, guys, this game was played on stream. It was a really fun one and I recommend you watch the whole thing. I hope you enjoy. Oh, that little sneak. Sneaky little golem, bruv. No way. Dude, I am a scripting Karthus player. You lose. I got script, baby! Oh, who's this Karthus? Why is he so gosh darn handsome? Sheesh, dude. That Kha'Zix. That's why you run exhaust on Karthus, guys. Balance champions. I love playing balance champions in League of Legends. Makes me happy. I guess I'll just gank this. It's going to take me 10 years to get that. Like, why am I? Like, my character is so slow, dude. My character is so slow. I don't, this is a bad situation. You just got tea bag there, my friend. Just die. Scripts, scripts, scripts. Give me that juicy stuff, baby. Sheesh. Karthus, man. Let me tell you. This champion is cracked as they come. When you play Karthus, it's getting sold by Karthus. Freaking hilarious. That's not a good feeling when you're playing an assassin and Karthus is bopping you with Qs. Good feeling for me, though. <laughs> My ears. <laughs> oh, that's funny. Seeing your guys' reactions like 50 seconds later is so hilarious.
I'm sitting on a full item, guys. Sheesh. Oh, I missed a Q there. I'm ready to back. I want to back and drop a fat R. Big old dump. Hot dump coming through! We lost chapter. We'll grab this. We'll grab that. We'll grab this. Set up my R. Give me a free R kill and we win, guys. Carthus can AD carry. There's just no point right now. AD carry items are... Oh, I wish they didn't do that. I was thought I was going to get the kill on the Karma. I didn't realize Twitch still had his E. Oh, well. Yeah, I could probably just go solo this guy. I'm pretty big. Pretty big and girthy. Why are you taking this guy's camps, buddy? That was kind of funny, though. LOL Gimme that Got him! Lawnmower Karthus Yeah, I haven't gotten an R kill yet. That's, a, that's worse on Karthus. If you don't get free R kills It's very sad no Karthus should have to play a game of League of Legends without their teammates feeding him free kills. No, you normally just get R to get kills. You only use your R to soften if you have a fed teammate like a Zed going in or a fed Irelli going in. Generally, you only do it if it's a kill secure. It's a long cooldown. It's, it's, it's long enough to where you don't generally want to use it to soften. This game's over. Our Gragas is popping off and I'm popping off. Yo, you think you ruined Dutch's day? No, dude. I don't think so. Thank you for the 100 bits, though, DS Schroeder. I hope you didn't ruin his day. He's probably just tired because it's, it's bedtime for him. This Gragas is going hard. Welcome to Smurf Q, ladies. Kind of funny. I have my R ready. Can't believe I'm gonna miss out on. Okay, I got one. Thank gosh. Thank goodness. Is this. Oh, this is warded. He knows I'm here. Lol, look at this dude. Look at this dude. Why? Give me invisibility. Where's my speed up? Dude, why am I not speeding up? This is a scam. Riot Games. What is. What's happening here? I wasn't getting a speed up. That's not bedtime. I don't know, dude. Early bird gets the worm. Thank you for the 200 bits, Dutch. Peak ganking bot side. We are one big lich right now, man. I guess we're not a lich. We're a, like a 
necromancer or something. I think Evelyn's a lich. Well played, guys. This champ's too easy. Playing Karthus is like playing League on easy mode. Oh, wow, they almost stole it. Oh, wow, Ezreal. I should probably back for Mej. We should back for a big fat Mej Rooney. Be 25 stack Karth running around. Oh, I missed a Q. That sucked. Yeah, it sucked. I can't believe I died to that guy. I guess I was kind of low on mana and I was sitting on a lot of gold. That was not good of me to do that. Which mythic gives me the most cooldown reduction? 15 ability haste. 5 ability haste. 20 ability haste. So I'll get this. This gives me a lot of ability haste. 20 and eh, maybe I'll just go for Ludens. Ludens is really good. The guy shouldn't have died to Yone there. But boy, did he do some damage. Oh, wow. Top lane is having some issues right now. I need to go invade Kha'Zix and take his stuff. Uh, I thought I could take them both from a distance. Not quite. That Gragas are though... Oh, he's got everything up. Poor guy. Where the hell did Kha'Zix go? Hmm, that was weird. Kha'Zix saw Santa, but he didn't see me. They're actually coming back. These guys are no lie coming back into this game. That sucked. I missed a Q there. I landed one of them, I just missed the second. Yeah, I don't want to push in too deep. I have R. Trinomir just takes the fight. Get wrecked. You need to get him lower than that. Oh, he had shield bow, that sucks. They took my stuff, no way. They took everything, bro. They took blue and Karam. Why? He's out of there. Who took my stuff, though? Did Twitch steal my camps? The Kha'Zix wasn't even over there. I'm just gonna smite it to heal back. Garen's coming. I don't have a Ravenous, by the way, guys. I've been chilling on Ultimate Hunter this game, doing just fine. 
Oh, I'm gonna keep farming. What is the point of delay? Because there's sweaty ghosters. Sweaty Betty ghosters is the only reason to have a delay ever in any game, ever. Same reason why there's delays for ranked games if you want to spectate live on OPGG or something. Ghosting isn't generally an issue, but if you're playing high elo or smurky or if you're a streamer, it's a thing. So for most players, it's not an issue. It's just for certain. If people want to queue up at the same time and play against me, they can, but they're not going to have an advantage. They'll probably just get rolled on a, on a botted account into my Karthus. Rolled like a, uh, a batch of rolled oats, dude. I should just get hourglass against these guys. Hourglass is gonna be really, really good versus their team. Oh wait, you know I'll wait for it. I'm really fed. My R should be able to crack some heads here. We are up uh, about ten camps on Kha'Zix. Ten or eleven camps. Forty CS. I don't think my R would have killed Garen there, that's why I didn't do it. Do 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 do. All right, let's go invade. Give me a tip on how to play Trundle. Yeah, you don't play Trundle. That's the biggest tip. You don't want to play him. Period. Trundle late game isn't good unless they have a tank for you to ult. If they don't have like a Ramus for you to press R on late game, Trundle's absolutely terrible. I literally hit him with a Q as he went to, like, recall his body. Get him low. Yeah, buddy, I got a double. Whoa! We got the Ezreal. Gragas said, Ty, it wasn't about you, Gragas. I was just doing to get the karma. This isn't about you, Karthus. Do I want to get a tier just for fun? Kicks and giggles? All right, let's get a tier. We'll get tier into lawnmower Karthus, build double burn items. Absolutely mulch these guys. Hourglass counters Yon really hard. Whenever Yon does his shadow thing, at the end of it, it's like a ZR. It does a bunch of damage depending on how much damage he did to you. So if you can hourglass that, he misses out on like half his damage. Custom badges, these Ugo star things. I think I do have custom badges. I'm pretty sure. Maybe there's like a way for you to activate it. From my perspective, I'm seeing like a custom badge right there. Maybe I'm confused. That sucks. I'm dead. Really need some teammates over here, bro. I just lost 10 mesh in a shutdown because Garen literally still had R. Like, I don't get it. If you're going to get caught out that hard to where the enemies have their R's, I just shouldn't have gone in there. That was my bad. These guys can literally win with their comp, though. That's like the frustrating thing. Like, if Twitch is going to just keep running it down like this. This is very losable. You guys might want to go for the Kha'Zix. Excellent this jungle. Nice. Yeah, we actually, I don't think we outscale these guys at all, to be honest. I think they way outscale us. They've been getting shutdowns on me, too. 
And they have no camps up for some reason. Got a dark car stack, feels good. Testiclops, thank you for the three months, man. We need to play for dragons. Best runes for Kha'Zix? It's generally Dark Harvest or Conquer. It just depends on which way you're going to play them. This Twitch is really, really passive. I hit Kha'Zix with a Q. He lost a big chunk of HP there. That's not good. He just lost like half his health. I think I can kill him. Yeah, let's go, buddy. Let's go. I have nothing to push. I could go grab midwave or I could just take a full clear here. We can, we're not going to be able to take turret in time anyways. So I'd rather just take this. There's no reason to auto attack camps at this point. You're just better off going gunship mode. It is kind of crazy how they're catching back up. Trindamir really should take their red buff. He's got 230 CS. He's actually pretty big. Did Trin get it? Oh, he got the red buff. Nice. Very nice. Hopefully I don't die anymore this game. I don't want to lose more mesh. If we get Dragon Soul, I think we just win by default. Like the Yon and the Garen are going to scale really well into me. I need my... Uh, I need my uh, burn item. Like that's just... Like why does that happen? We shouldn't be getting caught out like that. Just randomly dying mid like that. He's playing really far back, holy cow. I can't go for this blue buff, it's too deep. Die, you rat. Oh, man. I wish Twitch players would stop going AP. AP Twitch is not as good as AD Twitch, especially when you have double AP. When you have double AP on your team, going AP Twitch is kind of troll. Just go crack and Slayer. Get the Bork. Dude, we might, we're like actually losing right now. What is happening? Come on, Trindamir. You can do it. <laughs> I love Lawnmower Karthus. Just turning your E on and watching them go. Is Karthus a viable mid lane or not really? He has too many bad matchups. Karthus is a much better jungler than anything else right now. I need to back off. This is getting a little too personal. I don't want to deal with this Kha'Zix. My R's on a really low cooldown because I have Ultimate Hunter. I have five stacks. I 
Like, this Gragas is actually kind of running it down. Like, that's the third time in a row he's just died mid for no reason. Just like one versus two, one versus three. It's like, dude, what are you doing? Like, ugh, come on, guys. <laughs> like, what are you... Yeah, these people are just so interesting. They run it down and then they ping me, like, missing. I didn't, couldn't kill Young because he still had shield bow. His shield bow popped and soaked most of that. I'm going to have to get Leandri's instead of Luden's, I think. When you have the most KP in the game, most damage on team, and your teammates ping you when they run it down, that's just next level. Ah, uh -huh, Karthus, I just died out in the middle of nowhere. I'm gonna ping you. They're gonna get Dragon Soul on us. Nice. Chasing Ezreal is kind of impossible. Just keeps throwing out Qs. Nice. Alright, okay, this is winnable as long as they don't get Dragon Soul. When Yon fought us there, his R was down so he couldn't do much. Might be able to just end off that. One person up his Karma. I don't know why... I we're pulling off here. I guess we got to leave at this point. Just run, dude. <laughs> Why? Like, come on, bro. <laughs> Me and Gragas are leaving in the Senate States for like five more autos on turret. Nice job, Trindamir. Are any of them low? I guess I got a bat. Alright, I think I just get... I think I just get... I can't afford it, actually. I need one more camp. That's not good. <laughs> oh wow. Yeah, we can't, like we can't even, I don't think we can really fight this. We need heal cut, we have like zero heal cut on our team. Kha'Zix isn't here yet at least. My R feels like it's still on a really long cooldown even though I have Ultimate Hunter. It's still like a minute and a half. I don't have Ravenous, so I don't actually really want to tank this. I don't have my R either. Trindamir went in so late. He could have gotten a triple while they were on my hourglass. If they chose to fight, they would have all died. Boy, oh boy. What a game.
Hourglass is a good item. You know he didn't get heal cut. Hourglass might actually be better in this case since he owns just a super all-in champ. I'll sell my Ludens and I'll go for Leandris. The monkey moments. Wow. Have you ever tried AD Uter jungle? I have. It's not good. Just play Phoenix. Phoenix is faster clears. Faster clears is the jungle meta right now. If Unless you're playing a single target jungler like Elise. Senna build his troll a little bit. Twitch to sell his items. At this point, no. He just needs to get Oblivion Orb. Hourglass was a really smart buy, but he needs heal cut. Like, our team has zero heal cut. No one's buying it. I think everyone has me muted, which is crazy because I barely typed or pinged this game. We don't have a single executioners on our team when they have a bunch of self heals. It's kind of funny having this item. I don't know if this is actually worth it. It's giving me over 100 AP though. Should probably just go rob it on. They always walk into this bush. I might be able to kill Yon here. Hey, get wrecked. Skill, 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 skill. Let's go. The Karthus R, baby. I think we should still contest Dragon. I don't know if we can end because I don't have R. Neither just Trend or Twitch. We don't want them to get soul. I'm coming, boys. That chunk, those two Qs. I need Void Staff, my build is so bad. I think Rylize is worth it at this point since I've finished it, or I should say Seraphs. I have infinite mana, I could just leave my Eon in a team fight. We smacked that Eon with a Q, holy crap. Q did like half his health. Uh, let's go for a middle and hit, guys. How much AP is this giving? Oh, wow, this is giving it over 150 AP. That's kind of cracked. You're dead, Kha'Zix. Bye-bye. Oh, never mind. He had freaking Maw. I didn't realize. At least we have their inhibs. They're going to be trapped in base indefinitely. We should be able to get Dragon Soul on them. This game's hard to win just because they have some really strong meta champs like the Ezreal and the Yone, even though they're not necessarily like that good. Yone's really hard to deal with once he has like three items or whatever. He also has Conqueror, which is scales really nice. I don't want to sell that yet. I'd rather just get rid of this. I'll sell my boots at some point for an oblip for probably a Morello. Ooh, Robidon actually. Like I have 620 AP without Robidon. Once I have Robidon, I'll have like a thousand. Seraph's Embrace is giving me basically 170 AP. It's kind of insane. I have 162 AP. Trendimir is full build out. No, he's taking these camps. I guess maybe he's trying to sell his boots. He probably sees that I'm full build and thinks I don't need them. He doesn't know me. Cho'Gath jungle, you can. It's just kind of low tier right now. Lethal. Welcome, to, welcome back to the stream, man. Yeah, I have 3,000 mana. I can spam my E as much as I want. Anybody should really just split top. Oh, we got his banshees.
Yeah, we did an insane amount of damage there. RE alone did like half of two or three of their healths. This Twitch is so useless, bro. Holy crap. <laughs> well, look at his damage at the end of the game. I have a feeling he has like the least on the team. It's actually insane we can lose these fights. Like, <sighs> I'm in the front line, <laughs> cutting their team in half. We just do no damage. Oh, wait, why'd he stop? You have it, bro. They're all three in base. You can see them all. I guess he doesn't feel like he has enough healing. Kha'Zix is the only one who has real magic resist the rest of our armor, even though we're super AP heavy. I don't think they realize Twitch built AP like a goon. You only build AP Twitch on your team when you need it. Like, you don't just build it to build it. AD Twitch does way more damage. AD Twitch with Hurricane can kill the whole enemy team with a couple of autos. AP Twitch is more of like early mid-game power spike. Which you don't do when your team already has two huge AP champs like the Gragas, Karth. I think I even exhausted Yon that fight. We just couldn't kill him. I don't know what Trin's doing. He actually outsmited me. I don't know if we lose off that or what, but. Okay, end. 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 Yeah, I, I smited that bad. He hit it with a Q smite and it did like 2k damage. I could have like a more AP at this point if I get Robin Ons. Hopefully we can end. If we can't, I'm going to be really sad because they have Dragon Soul now and we're already losing team fights. Just hit the base. Just run past him. If you guys are wondering what low elo smurf queue looks like, this is it. Anyways, I hope you enjoyed this Karthus jungle commentary guide. If you did, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. My name is Kingsticks. Thank you for watching. I'll catch you guys next time.